Hey Aquarius, it is the Sun Sage doing your July reading where I'm taking a look at the month of July for you guys and making some predictions and seeing what the energies are, okay, to give you like a heads up and to let you know what's going on. So this is for Aquarius placements, also cross watchers of Aquarius. Uh, this is a general reading, so take what resonates for you, leave what doesn't, apply it how it resonates. Everything may not resonate, um, but it can resonate for others. So just be mindful of that throughout the reading. If you do need something more specific, make sure you check out the details in the description box to see how you can book a personal reading with me. All right. So Aquarius, let's take a look at some themes for you in the month of July. Support. All right. What do we have for Aquarius? Influence. And forgiveness. I feel like you're influencing someone. This feels like a relationship reading strongly. It feels like you're influencing someone who um, wants to be better for you. Okay. Someone you're showing that you're your support for this person, that you're there for this person. You could be like a supportive partner for someone in July. You could be dealing with somebody who has like a lot of stress who's going through a lot, who feels very overwhelmed. And so you're showing up as a strong rock for someone with support. You're showing up as someone who has some influence in this person's life. All right, so let's see. Why do we have support for Aquarius? The magician. Yeah, you make somebody believe in themselves. This can also, of course, be you having support around you and a strong team, a strong um, support system that feels like they support you, your vision, your dreams, your manifestations. There are people that believe in something that you that you could be working on, um, something that is work related, something that uh, will bring in money. Um, I also feel like this is about uh, helping someone believe in themselves, okay? This is about mending a relationship through support and forgiveness. For the most part, that's a big theme for you guys in um, July. The magician is the hermit. Yeah, somebody could, you could, so it, it could be a um, cross watcher, but somebody could be more outgoing. The other person can be more shy uh, with the hermit energy and the magician. Somebody is like really creative and really bold with their creations. And somebody else may be really like humble and really like subtle about their talent. So um, Aquarius, you could be helping somebody like get out of their shell. You could be supporting this person as they um, step back into like social life even okay let's say this has been somebody who's retreated for a while i'm strongly getting yeah the moon somebody may have went through like a, a spell of depression or somebody may have gone through something this could definitely be an aquarius okay so apply how it resonates but somebody went through something and there's somebody here or a good support system helping them come out of that this could be your lover eight of wands I feel like um, you're strongly helping somebody see their potential and see where they can take their talent, where they can take their gifts. I also feel like somebody may say something in July, like you need to stop hiding your talent. You need to like get online. You need to be more visible. You need to start going to this or that to showcase your talent. So I am getting that there are some opportunities being presented to somebody in the month of July where it feels like, um, because of the strong support they have, they're going to be able to get something off the ground or um, take a class. Like somebody is just like really being supportive right now. Aquarius, you could be teaching someone how to do something. You could be a mentor to someone. Princess of Pentacles. Okay. It feels like there's like a job opportunity or some type of offer. That somebody's going for knight of swords i feel like you could also be standing up for someone somebody could feel like they've been maybe bullied there's the five of wands right there okay if that princess of pentacles was like a child a teenager a sibling of yours a family member you're yep because there it is right behind the five of wands the princess of pentacles somebody could feel afraid um of like going into 
certain environments because they may get picked on or bullied. So something about your energy in the month of July feels like it is very inspirational to this person. You standing up for someone. Someone could be standing up for an Aquarius. Holding somebody down is also coming through. Somebody who's been struggling, who's been overwhelmed with emotional, mental uh, depression issues with the moon here. It feels like they have like your support. Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, Two of Wands. So the Knight of Swords with the Two of Wands definitely feels like you're helping somebody find their way. It feels like somebody may have gotten lost. Somebody definitely feels overwhelmed, like they were all over the place, even to a pentacles, and you're helping somebody find balance. Again, this could be reversed. Somebody could be helping an Aquarius do this, but I do feel like somebody's life is realigning and getting back in check with some help. Aquarius, you could feel more confident about moving towards like a business decision you're making. You could feel like way more confidence than you did a while ago. Eight of eight of uh, swords here. It could feel like you have like a lot of these thoughts um, about maybe limiting thoughts, but maybe just a lot of thoughts about how to do something. But I do feel like you guys are going to find like some sort of peace and clarity on how to move forward. Somebody has like an overactive brain, like you just always on, like thinking, always thinking about new things. Yeah, I think you are going to have a breakthrough about something that's important to you in the month of July. It's a relationship or a creative venture. The devil, something you are passionately connected to, something that you are very invested in because you're so passionate about it. What's the devil? The Three of Pentacles. This is help, counseling, working together. This is some type of support showing up, you know, helping somebody possibly get through addiction, helping someone get through um, something that they're tempted by that's not good for them. OK, um, a lot of you are definitely showing up as a rock. For an individual here who who feels blessed to have you. OK, somebody could have felt left out in the cold. But you're helping them so they feel supported. Ton of swords. I feel like somebody does kick an addiction or a habit because you're helping them fight it. Seven of Wands. There's definite energies here. Somebody being victorious over some type of addiction with help. Aquarius, you may also forego like people people's in, input on what you need to do on a situation you may choose to do some go alone or do something on your own here with the seven of wands defending your position or why you're doing something influence some of you could be coming influencer could be becoming influencers three of swords knight of pentacles Yeah, I strongly feel like you are helping somebody heal their heart, heal their pain, their suffering. You're very influential on this, this person. You're very important to them. They listen to you, King of Wands. You inspire them, okay? You're helping this person tap into their talents and their creativity. Some of you can have a strong influence on your person, okay? Helping this person like get their money in order. You, you could be forgiving this person and still working with them despite they, the fact that they hurt you. You could just be going slow with them. But you know this person has potential and you know they have a lot to offer. The Nine of Wands with the King of Wands. Yeah, somebody's fighting very hard to be the best version of themselves because of your influence and inspiration. Two of Cups and so they can be with you. I feel like that's somebody's main goal. To be like you, Aquarius, or to be with you. With the two of cups here. So this feels like um, someone's strong desire is to do what they need to do in this nine of wands energy. To put up a fight, to be with you, um, or again, to be like you because there's the princess of wands. It could, it could actually be both, 
right? You could have like somebody looking up to you right now. And you can also have like a love. You could just be really influential in your circle, in your life to the people around you. And so you could be just inspiration for everybody. And it's having a different impact on different people. Somebody wants to go into the same field you're in because of your influence. Somebody wants to get over an addiction because you got over yours. It doesn't have to be that, right? But just an example, there's no shame in that. It just feels like you're inspiring Um possibly more than one individual around you to be the best version of themselves. Six of cups. Yeah, somebody is going back to like, it's going back to the way it used to be in July. So if you've been having like relationship issues, conflict in some area of your life, it feels like it returns to a sense of normalcy or something that you had gotten um, very familiar with. Okay, these are like good feelings. These are good times. All right, Scorpio here, Leo, Virgo, Eight of Pentacles. Somebody's work ethic is returning as well, okay? Somebody has like um, a stronger work ethic now. Somebody is really doing their best to show you that they, that um, you're not taking a chance on them in vain or you're not giving them another shot in vain. Somebody is really doing the work. Okay. Somebody you love forgiveness. So I strongly feel like you guys are mending relationships in your life. Princess of swords. You're being watched in a good way. You're being watched. You're an example. All right. Um, with the princess of swords, I feel like you're an influencer or people are watching you online. You may give like some letters or messages. Hey, Aquarius, you inspired me. Look, princess of wands again, princess of swords. You're inspiring like the youth or something or like people younger than you around you. Your kids are inspired by you, Aquarius. Kids in your family, the kids that you teach. Your lover could feel like a student, right? Because you're representing a mentor to this person. So this is actually really beautiful. The hang woman. You're in a, 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 a position of leadership as well. Where I feel like um, you help people see themselves as worthy. People who have been insecure, people who are unsure of themselves. Some of you could take on a new role at work or a new job, counseling or something, giving people hope, giving people faith. The star, there's your energy. You are the star. You, you're an earth angel to a lot of people around you is what it looks like here. Two of Pentacles, helping people change in a good well, in a good way, helping people adapt um, to new circumstances, helping people find their abundance. A lot of people look at you as like mother, teacher, empress, um, abundance. You have it all. They want it all too. You know, you're, you're a big example to the people around you. Six of wands. The work you are doing, Aquarius, is not going unnoticed in July. You're being congratulated. You're being appreciated. I feel like you're forgiving someone because they're showing up appreciating you a lot more than they once did. Yeah, this is strong, like, relationship. You know, finally, somebody is, like, realizing they don't need to be taking you for granted. The Six of Wands with the lovers is very beautiful, like, putting a relationship on display, maybe a testimony going online and going, this is what we went through. We want to help other people. Something like that is happening. You have a major influence in July. People are watching you. They trust you, okay? So, Aquarius, that is what I have for you. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. Don't forget to hit that like, subscribe. I do appreciate it. If you are interested in booking a personal reading with me, check out the details in the description box.